What's good, YouTube? I'm back again, bringing you more Mortal Kombat X. This chapter three, which is Sub Zero in the storyline. You know we are doing the storyline. It is Cody with me today doing Sub Zero because it is his turn. Because we, you know, we go back and forth each and other chap, each other's chapter. He did chapter one of Johnny Cage. I did chapter two of Kodo Khan. So here is Cody back again with chapter three of Sub Zero, who is one of his favorite characters, which we actually agreed upon this because in the long run, I am not good with Sub Zero in this game. Move. So I hope y'all enjoy this and watch Cody just dominate. And of course, you all know to like, hit, smash that like button, leave a comment down below, tell me what y'all want to see and how y'all enjoy the video, and subscribe to my channel so I can bring y'all plenty more. Follow me on Twitter if y'all want to get updates and stuff. Send me a tweet. Tell me what y'all want to see. If maybe y'all want to fight me or fight Cody, we'll be more than happy to oblige. So I hope y'all. I hope you guys enjoy. Damn it, Jin. You. You. I need to see this. You are not welcome here. State your intentions. Grandmaster, we need you to come with us. My name is Sergeant. Yet yes. you are cut off, surrounded. What will you do? My father always spoke highly of Sub Zero. He wants he to wants talk. Talk. Almost his first choice. Okay. okay. Let's try Pum. No. Wait. Wait. Straightforward, just like his cousin. Yep. Cassandra Cage. You lead this group, but they do not follow. What would your mother do? Stop wasting time. I believe I owe you an x-ray. I can do that too. <clears throat> Who said you can move out of this corner? You did, apparently. <laughs> he said he owed her an x-ray, so... <sighs> you are more like my mother than you think. I can foresee the four fights Cody's gonna do with Sub Zero. The four of them. Yeah, Sub Zero's that good. <laughs> Your power has revealed my intention, Takashi Tahita. No doubt no can she taught you how to use them. My father told me right, Grandmaster. Let us see. One character Cody doesn't want to beat the hell out of. I actually like Takeda. He's kind of a mix of all of them. He's, uh, the old man from Deception. What is his name? Shujiko? Yeah. The ability to mimic. Yeah, if y'all see a big difference between this video and the last two videos, because in both the last videos we were using characters me and Cody does not use, while in this one Cody's using one of his favorites. So that's what the difference is. Two down. Two to go. You are not your father. Not yet. 
I didn't realize the story played into the factions too. Damn it. You announced your arrival, Jacqueline Briggs. Special Briggs. Yes. Military decorum is important in your family. If you know my father, you know me. Thought you were here. Our history share a dark chapter. The fact that he sat there and watched as him, he, her dad got his arms ripped off, and then did something about it afterwards. right now so watch out for it I didn't know she could do that it was interesting though okay she'll have her <laughs> three down one to go do not judge yourself specialist Briggs He has to be a smart ass, just like his uncle. Cousin. Cousin, yeah. Cody should be able to read hit, read Kung Jin like a book because that's who I use. Oh, and he's using the actual stance I use as well. So Cody should be able to read him like a book. <laughs> Done. False bravado does not suit you. Like I said, guys, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter. That is four fights. So I will stop the video as soon as it pops up chapter four. Sub zero. As soon as it says chapter four, I'll end the video there and we'll start the video right where it says chapter four. So, like I said, guys, I'll see y'all in the next vid. You're gonna catch hell if you kill us. Yes, I suppose so. Chuo, Dang Jin. That worked. This was all a, a a training exercise. Damn, I should have seen it. You and your friends show much promise, Cassandra Cage, but until you function as one, you will fall short. So other than that, you enjoyed your visit. The Lin Kuei shredded us. You, maybe. I see plenty of frozen boot prints on your ass, too. Come on now. You're all winners in my book. New orders from General Blade. Priority one, 
Outworlders. Here in Earthrealm. An invasion? Couldn't be. You're not afraid, are you, Mr. Cage? Outworlders, I can handle. So when did they show up? The portal opened by the docks a few hours ago. Nearly 5,000 in all. Refugees. From the Outworld Civil War. Must be bad if they risk coming to Earthrealm. After you. Do not dwell on your encounter with the Lin Kuei, son. It's pretty hard not to. Thanks, Kenshi. Could you and Mr. Cage join us? Sergeant Cage, you and your team as you were. This is Li Mei. She seeks asylum for her people in Earthrealm. Our village, Sando, was the epicenter of a fierce battle. We barely escaped with our lives. Such is war. I mean, no offense, but you outworlders kind of live for that, right? This was different. The rebels, Melina, had a weapon unlike anything. Entire battalions erased. It was not honorable, not combat. Tell me more about the weapon. A talisman, gold, with a center jewel. Melina wields its crimson energy without precision. Well, that's good then. Not now, Sergeant Cage. It is enough that she possesses it. It turns the tide in her favor. The Emperor grows desperate, and those caught in the middle pay the price. If this talisman is what I suspect it to be, we may all pay a price. We talking about Shinnok's amulet? Can't be. The base, the vault, your wardings. SF, Shaolin, no way anyone can get past all that. I must be certain. Well, this is cozy. You remind me of an Earthrealmer who crossed over with us. He also found humor in everything. Handsome guy, right? He was an Earthrealmer. One of his eyes glowed red. What does she mean? Kenshi, continue with Lee Mei. I'm going to the refugee camp. <laughs> Gotta get to him before he finds a way out. I'll come with. Go get an update on camp security from Colonel Flagg. Why? Because then you won't be here. Are we with you? No. I need to confirm with Kotal Khan that Lime's story is true. You and your team are going to Outworld. <laughs> 